Hello darlings and welcome back to video 2 of Vlogmas I am not doing them every single day but every once in a while when something is happening and today we're gonna go to the Christmas market it's December 3rd so it's about time we have two Christmas markets at the moment in Glasgow we're gonna see which one we're gonna go to but at the moment I am going to work that's why I'm dressed like that hair is slicked back and I have my earmuffs on, of course, because otherwise my ears would fall off, it's so cold and yeah, it's early in the morning, I don't know if you can see the sky, but it's actually beautiful it's like a candy floss kind of sky so I'm gonna stop vlogging now because I need to put my gloves on but I'll see you tonight when we go to the Christmas market we actually ended up not going to the Christmas market at all just because it was so busy that we were walking 2 meters for 5 minutes so we decided to leave it for another day but let's go on to another Christmas day so we just came to TK Maxx together with mom and dad as well mom don't do that please so yes we're gonna see what's in here because that's the kind of thing for me so let's see what we have quite a lot of doggy sweaters sadly Sammy cannot wear anything like that because his nails caught into it so are there any t-shirts and a quick outfit of the day we have the H&M skirt again because I'm loving it my Zara roll neck together with my opaline jewelry it kind of matches my phone as well my tiny tiny bag now this one is kind of cute you know how much I love each other I mean that's an each other bag as well at the moment that I have you can see the each other and actually I like the strap as well I think they have them black so let's go and find them I have this style as well which is very cute I've showed you this one before and the shape there's something about it that I really really like and if it was bigger I would have definitely gotten it for work we have found it and it has the strap again with the each other writing on it I actually really, really like this bag. And there's this one as well, which is really cute. So there's not much in terms of clothes, so now we're at the Christmas section to see if there's anything that catches my eye. This one is actually cute, but what am I gonna use a snow globe for? It's cute though. The one with the ballerina. One of them is actually nice maybe to put over the fireplace or to decorate the actual tree with it because it has flowers, it has greenery, red beads, so it's gonna feel very, very homey. I found some very cute ornaments for the tree but I'll show you later on properly. Now there are some over here which are cute like this house but that's really too heavy. Oh, oh my god! How cute is that? Oh my god, that's... okay. I think I need this. Let's see what's out there. Cute. Mm, that's a no. This one is cute if it wasn't red. Especially the biggest Santa. It's as tall as me, honestly. Those ones are cute, but are a little bit floppy. TK Maxx was a little bit disappointing, but now apparently we're gonna go to Nando's. So I am very, very excited about this. And then I have to go to H&M and return the bold dresses that I tried on in the previous video, which just look horrendous on me. So I'm gonna do that now instead of tomorrow before work. So let's go to Nando's. Usually I go for the wrap, today we're going for the chicken butterfly with the creamy mesh So like I said, we are in Nando's today I'm gonna try the peri peri hot sauce together with my chips and chicken And you can probably see the excitement in my eyes because I wasn't expecting the fair balance as well So yeah show you what comes afterwards because I'm actually seven. here it is butterfly wings with scent of mashed potatoes where are my fries I have extra fries Listed. Dot, uh, that's chicken wings that my dad has and that's what my mom is ordered 
quick look at H&M darlings just to see if there's anything interesting. That's kind of cute for like a Christmas PJ set. Just to show you quickly this one because it's actually pretty cute. And this one as well. I think I would wear both of them at home rather than out, but still pretty cute. Maybe this one for like a Christmas PJ. Hmm. On our way home, darlings, we had stopped by Tesco now. By the way, that's actually a really cute idea. Look at that. It's actually really cute and you can decorate this if you don't have like your own place with me. So cute. Okay, so yes, we are at Tesco. No, I prefer the other one. This one is fake, the other one is real. So yes, we are at Tesco just to gather some more things for tonight's dinner, even though we are just back from Nando's. I brought my leftovers to Georgie. Did you enjoy it? Yes, yeah. the good chicken. It was a good chicken. And he looks really good with that vest, by the way. You look really good. Going for our necessities. Da -da -da -da. Three in one coffee. Getting two just because I drink them every single day. And now Georgie, what are you getting as well? Lavazza? Um, I don't see the lavazza. Lavazza. Huh, it's over here. One of them? Oh yeah. Okay. Next thing, Dad is making some sort of a... Chicken. No. Next thing, Dad is making some sort of a dessert, which is going to be very, very delicious. I know what it is because it's one of my favorites, but I'll show you later on. Hopefully, he does make it, but that's why we are at Tesco, to get the ingredients fresh. Do I need this or do I need this? The flowers are actually very beautiful. The rest, it looks like like an iceberg salad but the flowers are so beautiful I've left Georgie so let's have a look at the home section this one is actually pretty cute I don't think I need another one but this one is extremely cute 8 pounds not too bad for the size of it let's see what else I need some Christmassy decoration for the whole home why would somebody buy that I don't even know what it is dish jack as well together with the plates i don't even know how that tastes like but it looks delicious and we're back home dad is preparing dinner for tonight and i just wanted to show you what i got from tk max meanwhile so you can see it properly because it's the cutest thing ever like i said i'm already in the christmas spirit my christmas tree is arriving in a couple of days so i am preparing for it and so i got some christmas decorations of course that's the first one. Ah, how cute is it? It's a little mouse running and carrying a cake. How cute is it? And the actual cake has like sparkles on it. The mouse has a blue color. It's the cutest thing ever. And it's just gonna go on the Christmas tree. So cute. So that's the first thing from TK Maxx. Second one is something a little bit more basic and that's a cookie ornament. It's just very cute and I like the combination of brown and white and even better when it resembles a cookie. <laughs> Sammy actually thought it was an actual cookie so he started licking it and trying to bite it. <laughs> he was really funny, I should have filmed that as well. And on top of my list of favorites from today is another mouse and this one is even cuter because it's a mouse in a cup. It's sleeping guys, it's sleeping. The color is again sparkling and blue. The actual cup is very very light pink, but it's not like too pink, it's the perfect amount. And I'll put it on the Christmas tree just like this. And the theme of the Christmas tree is going to be a little bit more of a, I don't know, mix and match situation with cutesy things like this and some normal ornament bowls. I don't know what color it is going to be, but I want it to feel a little bit more warm than previous years because usually we go for silver or gold and it just 
it doesn't give me the right vibe so hopefully i make it right this year but yes that's what i got from today it was a lovely experience because we went to nando's and i ate my favorite chicken and now i'm gonna eat more chicken for dinner so hello stay darlings to another vlogmas video you can see that we have a christmas tree already and it is the 8th of december now so it has definitely been a while this one just got delivered a few days ago but i've been running around trying to find different ornaments for it because i don't feel i just don't know what color i should go for this year i have no idea i want something warm but at the same time i don't want anything green red or a gold <laughs> so i just went with random things that make me happy and i'm gonna show you in a little bit right so that's the christmas tree i bought it off of amazon actually yes i have wednesday on the background so i've stopped it while i'm filming this a I really liked it because of the base, because it's something a little bit unusual and I feel like when we have the Christmas presents underneath it's gonna look very very cool. It is mid-sized Christmas tree so not too big because we don't have our own house yet and I didn't want to invest in a big one and when we move to our own place in a year or a few months it's not gonna fit there perfectly so that's why we opted for something smaller this one actually has integrated lights which is perfection because i didn't have to buy any additional ones and let me show you the different ornaments that i've gotten for it these bubbles are something very simple i got them from tk Maxx, but i just thought they look very candy like i got four of them this one I got from TK Maxx previously as well, so it looks like a cookie. This little mouse in a cup is the cutest thing ever. So I basically went for things that really make me happy. The same with this mouse over here. It's carrying a very cute cake. It's running and carrying a cake. Then from House of Razors I found this too, which is a cup and this thingy that I don't know the name of but they're very cute and they made me happy when I saw them so I bought them so I am basically nowhere near done with the Christmas tree however I went to my parents house and they have few different decorations from our last year's attempt at Christmas trees so I am gonna start adding different things so we have only white options and I'm waiting for things from Shein to arrive to add a little bit more color to it hopefully so we're gonna see how it's going and in here by the way it's a complete mess because i've been trying to decide which boots to keep let me show you actually so we have those capris ones that i ordered both of them are from the one to lounge those are the capris boots and they're very beautiful it's dark brown they have like croc leather effect at the top they are flat boots so they're gonna be very very comfortable to walk in they are nice and warm on the inside as well so when you put them on they do feel very very comfortable however my heart is definitely with those massimo duty ones you can you can see they are slightly patent you can see the reflection of the lights and they're just beautiful they're classy they're chic they have a slight heel but at the same time when you put them on they are very very comfortable so at the end I think I am deciding to go with the Massimo Dutti ones. They're just more classy and I feel like that's what I'm missing because I do have comfortable boots from previous years in different colors. But still, I'm just gonna keep wearing my flat ones whenever I need them. But I need something more classy and timeless and beautiful to add to my collection. So I'm gonna go with the Massimo Dutti boots. And to be honest, I haven't had new boots for the past 2-3 years. I have been only with my shoe ones, if you have seen them everywhere. So yeah, I think it was about time to add something new. And also I want to show you a sneak peek of something. And yes, it's a mess everywhere because I've been filming that over there. It's from a very special brand and I'm gonna film a video once everything from that brand arrives. And it's gonna be something very, very stunning. So yeah. I'll just continue to decorate the tree, see if I can make it a little bit more festive and yeah, I'll be bringing you around whenever there's anything interesting. <laughs> 